Okay, let's see why I'm showing up for you, spirit team. Take over. Oh, uh, what does the person watching this need to know right now, darling? Okay, we've got the moon here, and we've literally just had the blue super moon in Aquarius. And I feel like, I don't know about you, but the energy has been energy in, okay? Oh, we've got the emperor in reverse. Okay, there's a sense of you being afraid to be the leader. There's a sense of you... I'm almost getting you're afraid to be seen. You're afraid to step out of of the norm you're afraid to be different because i feel like you are different not in like obviously not in a bad way but in a good way you are unique you have this incredible uniqueness about you that needs to be shared that needs to come out because you have so much to add to this world but you're hiding yourself right now you're like withdrawing yourself you're not feeling confident enough to be that person and I want to challenge you and ask you why. What's going on? Why are you hiding the true you, the authentic you? Um. Okay. Oh, yeah, Queen of Cups. Listen, you're also somebody who's very highly intuitive, okay? Very in tune with yourself. A m massive, massive empath, okay? You feel energy like nothing else. Um. I feel like the emotion that drives you is love. And you love love you you love love um and anything that you do whether it be work whether it be relationships like you always tend to put other people first a bit of a people pleaser okay so that's kind of what we need to work on um but i do feel like you do everything with love you want people to feel special because you know how good it feels to feel special when somebody makes you special when somebody goes out of their way to make you feel like that okay knight of wands and strength this is your message to essentially pluck up the courage to take action towards being the most authentic version of yourself. Because listen, your, you know, your empathy, your care and nature is not a weakness. If anything, it is a major, major strength. And you can utilize that to be the best version of yourself, to turn that around, okay, to pop that back up, upright, take the lead, um, use your emotions, use your intuitiveness, to really make a difference in this world because baby you are special like i want you to to really know that you are special you're seeing this message because the universe wants to remind you how incredibly special and needed you are in this world so this is essentially a reminder for you to not focus on the negativity that's going on around you or in the world in general and instead focus on your inner self focus on the love that you can literally share with other people right now what can you do today to share more love to to show somebody that they are valued that they are cherished that they are cared for wow yes ten of pentacles we've also got the two of pentacles and the magician um there's a sense and the two of wands there's a sense of you not really knowing what you are trying to manifest and i know that's um a little bit like, hmm, what are you on about? Of course I do. Because I, of course I know what I want to manifest. Three to one on timer. Mm, I don't think you fully do. I feel like there's a bit of a miscommunication with the universe right now in terms of what you are trying to create for yourself. Um, and I get that there's a bit of a mismatch between your material world and your internal world, okay? So I feel like on a deeper level, you just want love. That's all you want. And I'm not just talking about like romantic love. I'm talking about experiencing more love just in the world, okay? You want more love just amongst people. You don't want all this hate that's going on because, you know, that really affects you. However, there's also the material aspect of life where you almost feel a little bit guilty for wanting to be abundant, for wanting to have money. Um, because I feel like some of your subconscious beliefs are surrounding money, you know, being evil, money bringing greediness and all of that. But baby, that could be further from the truth. Remember, money is just energy. So you are meant to be abundant because your abundance you know that you'll share it with others. Like you know you are a very generous human being. So your it does having money doesn't make you evil doesn't make you greedy it's what you do with it okay it's the actions that you take with it so once again i feel like you just need the reminder to focus on what your vision truly is and you can combine the two okay you can want love for everyone and you can also want material abundance oh the hell's that yeah five of swords listen i know you're confused right now i know things are feeling very challenging right now for you um there's a lot of pain that you've been through, okay? You have experienced a lot of pain. Perhaps you've even caused a bit of pain to other people. But 
there is no point kind of going over the things that have, have happened. It's time to keep moving forward. It's time to, you know, I don't necessarily want to say like forget about the pain, but it's time to understand that that doesn't define your future, that you are in charge of creating that new future for yourself. The 10 of cups, your happy ending. I want you to start really focusing on what that happy ending truly looks like for you in all aspects of life and keep focusing on that. Keep taking aligned action towards that. You know, surround yourself with people that understand that, un that understand you most of all. And baby, it is time to step out of your comfort zone. It is time to show yourself to the world because you are needed. I love you.